couldn't cover like every everything because y'all know my videos be lengthy and I'm really trying to work on that okay and nobody's ever like complained about it but I still just I be getting annoyed just editing I'm like girl you are like 15 minutes in trim it down trim it down but you know Girl Jasmine Fox back at it again for another video. Today is going to be okay my favorite curly hair product. But first off, I have to say thank you to you guys. Okay, we have reached 1K subscribers, and I'm just so 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 thankful, so blessed. And I really just wanted to give a big thank you to you guys. And I also wanted to announce something that I would like to do. In the increase of subscribers, I've also been gaining a few, quite a few new uh, Snapchat followers. So I really wanted to do a Snapchat Q&A in celebration of reaching 1K, just so you guys can get to know me better and stuff like that. And basically, you guys can just send me whatever questions you guys have for me. I mean, anything, y'all. Don't be shy. Trust me, and I love responding to people on um, my Snapchat as well. So don't be shy, don't be scared, don't leave your girl hanging, okay? We need some questions, all right? And then I'm basically going to answer them in a live YouTube video. So yeah, that should be fun. So anything, okay? Don't limit it to hair, just anything. So if you're not following me on Snapchat, please follow me, okay? I'll put it up right here, okay? It's Jasmine Fox with five X's. Also, if you guys are not subscribed to me, please go ahead and click that subscribe button right down below and comment underneath whatever you guys wanna see, request or just anything. And yeah, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, okay? And click that little bell right down below next to the subscribe button, which will basically notify you uh, whenever I post a video so you guys can be the first ones to check it out, okay? So without further ado, we are going to get straight into the video. We're going to start off with my favorite conditioners. Conditioners I like to use in the shower. Some I use as stylers as well. And then we're going to move into the stylers that I love to use. And then lastly, the moisturizers. I'm not going to cover deep conditioners in this one because I don't want it to be too long. But if you guys want to see my favorite deep conditioners, which y'all know were like a key to my transitioning uh, journey, then please thumbs up this video and comment down below so I can get right on to that, okay? First and foremost, which is an old classic I've always been using, I love Tresemme Conditioner. This one is the Luxurious Moisture one. I'm never too really picky about which ones I use. However, I love this conditioner because it does have a lot of slip. It's very moisturizing and I use it in the shower and as a leave-in like all the time. A lot of times when I'm rushing out the house and I don't have time to really style my hair, I'll just use this conditioner and an oil of my choice and that's like a five minute curly hair routine. If you guys want to see my on the go curly hair routine when I don't have like any time to like really work the product through but it still gives me like bomb results then also thumbs up this video because I'll be glad to show that to you guys as well. But yeah, I love this conditioner. Very moisturizing. It has vitamin E in it. Also, what I love about Tresemme is they all have a uh, biotin in it if you read the ingredients, which is great for hair growth. So yeah, love this conditioner. Very moisturizing and it just works. It's great. I love Aussie Moist as well. Aussie Moist is extremely moisturizing y'all like and I just came across this like very recently just after watching a lot of youtubers and like I would just always see like girls with really really long hair or just beautiful curls they all use Aussie Moist so it might be even a little bit more have more slip than Tresemme but the moisture is great the slip is great I also love the like flavors of it y'all know I always call it flavors because I don't know what else to call it this one is the uh, awesome volume one so this one kind of had like an apple smell mm, yeah but I'm kind of out of it but I love these conditioners they smell amazing and I I was using these for um stylers as well so it's like a two-in-one thing so that's what I love about this one my last conditioner which it's classified as a conditioner but 
I, I never use this in the shower because I think it's kind of pricey. I don't even remember how much it costs, but I typically just use this as a styler. So this is the Cuckoo Oil uh, Conditioner by OGX. I used this in my curly hair routine video. If you guys haven't checked that out, I'll link it down below. This stuff, oh my gosh, okay? It, it's amazing. It leaves your hair so shiny and fluffy and soft and I just love it so much. I came across this like from my sister. Oh my gosh, also the smell is amazing. I love the smell, so good. What I love about um, this conditioner is that it literally will leave my hair so freaking shiny, like just shiny and soft. I don't know what they be putting in their conditioners, but OGX, like I just love all of their little conditioners as stylers. Whenever I'm doing like a curly hair routine or just really trying to define my curls, but keep them nice and fluffy, that's when I really, really love to use the OGX, okay? So you guys should definitely pick this up. I love it, okay? This is major key, okay? Major. After the conditioners, we're going to move on to stylers, okay? As you already know, the Cuckoo Oil one I just covered is one of my favorite stylers. The Tresemme one, which the top just popped off, sorry. But the Tresemme one, I love as a styler as well. Just as a base before I put in my other products or if I just wanna use this alone, like I said, with an oil, great as a styler, okay, for real. Something new, okay, that I just picked up is the Cantu Shea Butter for Natural Hair Moisturizing Curl Activator Cream. Actually, that's what I used in my hair just last night because I just styled my hair yesterday, put it up in a pineapple so I could take it down today. But this stuff, I really, really like how it feels in my hair and I love that literally a little bit goes such a long way like this is kind of pricey I don't remember how much this cost um dang I really don't I'll try to like post it put it somewhere if I can go look it up I've used this already twice and I you guys can't even see where it is it's literally just right here and I've used this twice it's so smooth it's like a butter running through your hair it just really really moisturizes the curls and um I like the way it made my hair feel. My curls definitely are very, very nice and coiled. So I love this stuff and it smells amazing as well. It literally leaves your hair just smelling great, okay? Another styler that I've really been using this in my hair quite frequently. I used to like only use this in like ponytails and when I would use it alone with um, my soaking wet hair it would make it flake up sometimes so that's why I kind of strayed away from it but I've really been like using this throughout my hair lately it's just about knowing how much to use of it this is the Cantu Shea Butter for Natural Hair Define and Shine Custard I'm running out completely as y'all can see but I actually paired this up with the Curl Activator Cream last night and again loved the definition the bounce the moisture my hair feels very very moisturized and the softness as well this is great for basically those days when i went to guarantee defined curls like definition especially in those stubborn areas like the back of my hair right here can be very dry and just not wanting to curl or coil or anything it'll be more so like a looser it's more so looser back there and really like throughout the whole entire top layer of my hair but anyways you know those products you use that you know you're guaranteed a certain result every time that's this one okay and that's why i love it so much because it literally will leave your hair defined and shiny. Again, you gotta know how much to use cause there's been times I've been left with flaky hair, but I noticed that when I pair it up with like a cream, especially the one in its line, like something like that, it never will leave my hair flaky. And the ingredients as well, as far as like really all these products, I mean, except for the shower conditioners, they got other stuff in them, but the stylers really have great ingredients, like fruit extracts and oils and all that type of stuff. So that's why I really, really love this product. So 
y'all should pick that up as well now lastly moving on to moisturizers favorite favorite moisturizers so in my deep conditioning routine y'all know that i'm incorporating hair grease back into my hair right now i just have the softy brand this is the herbal grow one and this is the castor oil one these greases are amazing okay the ingredients like this one is hair and scalp conditioner it's a castor oil the first ingredients i mean you see on the first three lines it only has four is castor oil coconut oil uh, jojoba oil olive oil safflower oil wheat germ oil like that's amazing like seriously okay and i've actually been doing uh quite a few scalp massages with this one i use this one sometimes but I just love the smell of this one so much and it's more so for thickening and growing your hair so that's why I've been using this one more so but this one still is amazing as well but I use this in my hair for scalp massages y'all at night when I get out the shower before I plait my hair up maybe just run something my hair and I love that these greases when you want them to get out they will get out like when I wash my hair it, it will get out and that's really what I love about these greases just as sealants and just as scalp moisturizers and scalp conditioners these are bomb okay so and then what just fell to the ground this right here <laughs> um shea butter y'all know i love me some shea butter this is just 100 percent pure african shea butter constantly putting this on my edges on my ends everywhere okay very moisturizing rich in lots of vitamins and fatty acids and stuff that's really going to make sure it penetrates your hair well so i use this on my skin my face my body my hair i love shea butter okay it's just amazing so this is also great for hair growth as well just great for moisture and shine and just uh re-strengthening your hair if your hair is damaged or transitioning and that's why i love shea butter the last moisturizer which i don't have with me because i know i keep in the little dish is some olive oil okay and olive oil just stands on its own i don't even need to hold it because olive oil to me is just it's nothing compared like i know naturals love the coconut oil and all that stuff but i just love olive oil like no offense like i remember when i would use coconut oil like i could barely tell i put anything in my anything in my hair like that's good if you want you know the fluffy soft not too heavy you know look but to me olive oil doesn't leave my hair heavy it leaves it just super shiny and super moisturized it guarantees once again the results that i like which is just deep dark rich looking hair olive oil is rich in a lot of nutrients and i'm sure probably vitamins and fatty acids and stuff as well which is great for the hair so you guys really really should try putting um olive oil in your hair if you haven't already always need some olive oil okay and then one last major major product i love love to put in my hair but I'm running out so I haven't been using it as much because I'm trying to hold on to it. This is the Affigy Keratin and Green Tea Restructurizer which y'all know that I used in my curly hair routine video as well. And I mean this literally is a restructurizer like whenever I spray this into my hair it feels so strong. It's got um keratin in it clearly and green tea and it also has some leaf extract vegetable protein fruit oil glycerin i mean there's a lot of stuff in here it's actually ph balanced as well so ph optimized this stuff y'all like if you're transitioning i can't stress this enough like just trying to repair your hair period this is awesome like i don't remember the exact price again i'll probably have to put that up somewhere but if you're just someone who wants to strengthen your hair up you're transitioning or anything you should have this in your arsenal okay in your curly hair arsenal because it literally will make your hair just so strong it will um just restructurize it like that's literally what it does i remember when i was transitioning my straight ends constantly just spraying this on my ends was literally helping them curl back up wave back up all of their products i'm not sure but from the ones i've tried 
They're great for just intensively repairing your hair and they do exactly what they say. It's not just, oh, we're gonna help you do that and then it ends up not doing nothing, okay? These really, really are bomb. Affigy, I love, okay? Major key and yeah, it's amazing. So y'all should definitely pick this up as well. You won't regret it, okay? I promise. So that is it for now. You guys should definitely check these products out and see if they work for you. Nothing's too like really crazy. So I'm sure y'all can find these at like a grocery store or a beauty store or anything. So yeah, again, thank you so, so, so much for 1K. Don't forget to send in any questions you guys would like into my Snapchat. I will definitely be doing a video very soon answering those questions. I'm excited to see what you guys want to ask me. I mean, anything, okay? Don't make it just about hair because this channel is not just about hair. I should probably even do a updated curly hair routine very, very soon because my hair has grown quite a little bit. Look at that, y'all. Okay? Quite a little bit. Ooh, I can't wait to straighten my hair soon, okay? It's coming soon, y'all. But um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I couldn't cover like every, everything because y'all know my videos be lengthy and I'm really trying to work on that, okay? And nobody's ever like complained about it, but I still just, I be getting annoyed just editing. I'm like, girl, you are like 15 minutes in, trim it down, trim it down. But you know, I just always have so much to say because I'm really trying to help y'all and you know, show you guys what has really been beneficial for me, okay? Thank you so much for watching and have a fabulous, blessed day. Love you guys so much and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.